Hi guys, Landy here with the Youth Minute, a topical Bible program that discusses biblical passages or questions that young people ask. If you have a question you want answered, please email sphcnh at gmail.com and in the subject line put Youth Minute. Okay, so here's a question. When should I do stuff for God? There are many young people who believe that doing things for God is something reserved for adults who have been Christians for many, many years. They believe that the only time that you are doing anything for God is if you are preaching, teaching the Bible, or evangelizing. While those things are important and do in fact fall into the category of doing things for God, there is still an infinite amount of work to be done. Everyone has their own part to play. Yes, some are called to be pastors or evangelists, but others are called to lead worship, play music, clean the building we call a church. There are people called to be counselors, to go on missions, to start organizations, make others laugh, write, make videos, and like I said, the list goes on and on. All of us are called to worship, pray, love, and talk about God, give, learn, and encourage. 1 Corinthians 12, 4 to 6 states, there are different kinds of gifts, but the same spirit distributes them. There are different kinds of service, but the same Lord. There are different kinds of working, but in all of them and in everyone is the same God at work. You can continue and read verse 7 to 11 in that chapter. You may not be called to bring God's work to the deepest part of Africa, but you have a job. The real question is, are you willing? God wants you to spread his word and love to others. All that's left for you to do is say, here I am, use me. If you are willing, God will make sure you take the steps to be an amazing instrument of his in this world. So here's my encouragement to you. You have a special job that God has given you to do. Remember that and don't ignore it. Ask him to reveal that job to you and let him know you're willing. We are God's light in this world, so we gotta shine. Thanks for listening. This Youth Minute is brought to you by Salem Pentecostal Haitian Church of Pennsylvania. Don't forget to like and subscribe to keep more content coming your way. And visit sphcpraise.com for more spiritual nourishment. God bless.